Look at everybody what Samantha did. You did that. I did not do that. Look at this. I do this vlog before I forget about it. Okay, you see these shoes? They're not yours. See these? <laughs> these are not mine, okay? Let me tell you what just happened. All right, Samantha's my witness. <laughs> I was, I was like, I spent two days videoing the most awesome footage on the planet in the Destin Harbor at night, time lapses, Crab Island. Crab Island. So we're out here on Crab Island. Samantha is right here. The rest of the crew are somewhere out here. Kayaks. There's a sick volleyball game going on. You got food here. Taco joint over here that's like a floating boat. Another joint over there. Well, peanuts and ice cream. So this is Crab Island, people. This is where I almost died. Look at that. Most beautiful place on the planet. So this vlog is an absolute personal blog because, or vlog, because I lost my most precious thing, my GoPro. Most All, precious thing. Well, except for Samantha over here. My, yeah, you know what I mean. And so I got to go buy another camera, which I'm glad I bought a 199 camera instead of a 499 camera. And my mom has to make me a new hat. Yeah, the $2 hat that Samantha's mom. <laughs> made that I tried to chase and die. I knew I was going to die chasing this thing. I totally knew I was going to die. I told him he shouldn't have chased it. But, it was you know, not worth it. My he chivalry code said, it. get this dog gone hat. And I rolled my kayak. Well, actually, it's Craig's kayak that he let me borrow. Coming back to where we were going to, you know, exfil our kayaks. And I rolled it. Chasing Samantha's hat <laughs> that she lost. I was I was paddling and chasing this thing down. The, the the hat was coming this way, I was like, I totally got this. I you know you know figured out my line to get this thing. And right when I went to grab it over I went. Okay. During all of that. During all of that. I was finding the current getting to where we're anyway, uh, anyways I was I was trying to find the current getting to our destination and a jet skier with a 17 year old boy came came up next to me as I was fighting it and said hey do you want me to tow you in just to just to help and I thought okay yeah that's cool so I hung on to the side of the jet ski tipped me right over underwater this little sitting kayak full of water go under grab the bag that my cell phone was in thinking i'm by myself have to save the the communication mechanism throw it to the kid and he towed me to safety probably took about 20 minutes because the current was so bad i'm searching for jack thinking he hasn't he hasn't paddled up yet and little did i know he was underwater as yeah, so I flipped, all right, and the current was sucking out the Dustin Harbor into the pass. And so first thing I did, recovery drill, I grabbed my life preserver and I put it on. Being a dummy, not having it on. Also, these dudes right beside us right now are totally making this completely hard to film because they're so loud. Anyways, okay, so I rolled this kayak back over and no GoPro. No GoPro. GoPro was gone. His hat. Footage was gone. Hat was gone. <laughs> shoes were gone. Okay. I am wearing somebody else's shoes right now. <laughs> So I'm some wearing somebody else's shoes right now with a shirt that I happen to have in my bag that was in Samantha's car. And no GoPro. no GoPro, no footage. Check out these shoes. They're 
like old school Jesus shoes. They're old school sandals, okay? And I'm hoping, hey, if you are watching this and you find a GoPro. In the Destin Harbor. In the Destin Harbor. And you happen to load the film and you see me. I will give you money to give me that, that GoPro. You'll be on my channel and you'll have my gratitude forever, okay? We're going to post this a lot of places to see if we can get this GoPro back. Yeah, it was totally just absolute sadness. I'm still hurting right now. She hates me for so many things, but I chased her hat. Such a such a good guy. From death to doggone determined. I'm so tired right now. I flipped that thing like five times trying to get back on it. It was the most epic rookie thing you've ever seen for big water kayakers. But if it would have been a big water kayak, it wouldn't have been the problem. It was a 10 foot Hopi pursuit. So here's my plan. I'm gonna piece together as much footage as we can find on my can on my phone my and Samantha's phone. Because we took some good videos on our phones. And, Always have a backup. And try to make this a good video. Because it was so epic. Like Crab Island is the most amazing place on the planet. And no footage. I had underwater footage. I had time lapses. And Beautiful nothing. sunset time lapses. Yeah. Okolusha Island, everybody. The boardwalk. Ah! Ah! Okay, so the Okaloosa Island boardwalk is right over here. Yep. And the Gulf Aquarium. Can you see it? Right there. Wait. There it is. Okay. I totally shot all this before and I lost it, so we're trying it again. Emerald Emerald Coast Convention Center right there we're, we're about to cross over the bridge and you can see the emerald coast water tower that's beautiful yeah it's amazing it's like this big emerald coast water tower you cut me off you cut me off every time I'm she's ranting about me cutting her off the water today was the greenest water we have ever seen when they say the emerald coast destin is the epitome of yeah. the emerald Coast. It's not emerald because it's a fine gem. It's emerald because the color of the water is truly the color of an emerald. Yeah, it's emerald. Like, like, see the bottom? It was beautiful green. Yeah, it's like when they say emerald on your finger, it was emerald that color. Check it out. Emerald Coast Water Tower. Hold on. See it? See the Emerald Coast Water Tower? Totally awesome. <laughs> Zip lining. So I think that zip lining episode is probably the wildest thing I've seen at a boardwalk yet. Alright everybody, so if you find a GoPro Hero 4 session at the bottom of the Destin Harbor and it happens to float up on some beach. It might have a headpiece on it. If it has a headpiece on it, it's mine, okay? And if you find it and you download the footage and you see this face, please return it to me and there'll be a reward, okay? And you'll be on my channel eternally as an honorary member of awesomeness. So please hit me up, Jack Motley. Look at everybody what Samantha did. You did that. I did not do that. Look at this. All right, Samantha, tell everybody. Tell everybody why you did this. I did not do it. I got the hooks out except for one that I couldn't get. Look at this. Am all right, I, am all right. I, I want myself. you to take a look at this. Look at that. Look how many fishing lures has been hung on my life vest. Jack Motley did that. Tell him. Jack Motley did that. He was careless with his gear. I got them all out except for one. I have no idea how to get all these hooks out of my vest. I what? You threw that on your hook. 
hooked. I did not. Yes, you did. That's all I get one hooked out. I don't know what you're talking about. But never fear. I got all the hooks off my vest. All right, everybody. So if you find a GoPro Hero 4 session at the bottom of the Destin Harbor and it happens to float up on some beach. It might have a headpiece on it. If it has a headpiece on it, it's mine, okay? And if you find it and you download the footage and you see this face, please return it to me and there'll be a reward. Okay, and you'll be on my channel eternally as an honorary member of awesomeness. So please hit me up, Jack Motley, 850-324-1673. Please!